Hey guys, sorry it's been a while, but um, I just wanted to share with you some of the things that I've been doing lately. So on a nice day like today on the weekends, uh, when the weather's nice, I like to, uh, come on a little bit closer, I like to uh, do some workouts outside where I'm not, you know, cooped up in the gym. And so one of the things that I've been doing lately is uh, I actually stopped by at a tire store near my house and I just asked them if I could take some tires home. And they were more than happy to give me some free tires because I guess they have to pay like a recycling fee. But uh, what I did was I went to Home Depot and I got these like uh, eye bolt, um, eye hole bolts and then a nut and a washer. So two of those, one on the inside, one on the outside. And then I just drilled a hole right through there and then just put this right through. And then I got these, uh, these are like luggage straps, I guess. And uh, they're 15 feet long. And what I do is just loop, loop them through there and then we just drag the sleds. Uh, tire sleds back and forth. So here we just have uh, this big tire And I'm just gonna take this little toe strap here and loop it through You get the one strap that's basically Then you get one strap one in each hand Just loop it through. It's cheap and it's fast. It's easy and basically that's it. We're ready to go. So we're setting up the other one. We're gonna have two tires going today. That should do it. Let's see, make sure this is tight. Yep. What I'm thinking we'll do is I'll load it up. We'll probably do what you were just doing. One going backwards like this. So one like this. So today for the smaller tire, what we'll do is we'll put a 45 pound plate on top. Load it down a little bit more, make it a little bit harder. Big one right here. I'll put this other tire on top of that. This thing is probably another like 40 pounds or so too. So we'll do the workout with both of these loaded. If it ends up being too light, we'll go heavier. But I think this is gonna be okay because we're gonna probably be doing like 20 rounds. So today doing this workout with me, I got my neighbors. We have well, Gordon and Ryan. And it's always good to have friends to suffer through this kind of stuff with because it's going to be pretty awful. So we'll see how we feel in like half an hour or so. <laughs> for your form, for the for the backwards drags, uh, keep the lower back straight. So never round out your back. So you plant your feet kind of shoulder width apart. And then you're going to give it a really strong pull backwards. Yeah, perfect. Just like that. And then you take a step back, straighten it out again, plant your feet again, and then real hard back. Okay.
shot for the Instagram. More plates. I don't even know how long that took. How long did that take? I don't know. I, I didn't check the time when so, we started. Just finished 20 rounds of the sled drags. It's pretty awful. I don't know. How'd you guys feel? <laughs> Felt good. Felt <laughs> good. I just switched to the lower weight. <laughs> oh, that's fine. Yeah, so uh, it's kind of a typical weekend workout. Um, hopefully, I'll be uploading more. So if you guys stick around, appreciate everybody's support. And uh, I'm going to post these guys' Instagrams on my own as well. I've been posting some more stuff there, so I'll see you guys around. Alright, it's good enough. Thanks for your help. Yeah. Okay.